Where'd you make of that? Oh, that was a difficult day for both teams, I would have thought. Um, small, narrow ground, um, 50 kilometre winds, howling down one way, and in the end, the rain comes. So, look, I thought there was some good intensity. I thought they were putting us around the contest for a fair bit of the day and probably didn't handle the conditions that well. But then I thought, you know, we, we fought it out, um, exposed some of our young players, and, and got within maybe, I don't know, six or ten points. So. Um, yeah, last quarter. But the last quarter is reflective of the conditions. Whoever had it basically got on top. It was a pretty difficult day. I'm talking to John Longmire during the week, and, and he was saying he was, this was a sort of a, an ideal encounter. You know, at this stage of the preparation, getting a lot of you know hard physical stuff in, and even if it is challenging, it's still good good stuff to tune up with. Yeah, look, I think that's a fair observation, and, and John's quite astute. So. Um, yeah, it was quite physical. Sometimes there's a bit more than you would like. You know, it was pretty tough. I think there'll be some sore people. Look, I think both teams tried to open it up a bit too, like held their forwards and all those sort of things. So, um, but at the end of the day, it was an AFL game where you had to run and work and had to put your head in the hole a bit. So um, it certainly won't hurt us. But um, yeah, we've got a couple of little concerns. So um, Zungu tightened up in the hamstring neurally, so we think he'd be okay. But Valentine looks like he's hurt a calf. So. Um, that's a concern, you know, if it is, you'll, you'll probably miss round one, so um, that's not ideal, but, you know, Fife and Ibbotson and, and Mundy sort of returned a bit, Mundy tightened up, but so, um, you know, we backed him off, and look, we've got a few to return as well, so, um, in a real sense, maybe there's up to eight or ten, sort of, of our best 22 probably out, so, yeah, there's a, there's a bit that we need to, obviously, regenerate them and get them in, but um, there's some upside as well, so. Yeah, we get on, not ideal, tough day, and, but I thought we fought, fought it out quite well. Which of your younger players do you feel did well today? Right? Well, I think Connor Blakely certainly showed that he's clean, he's brave and he's smart. We just need to condition him to AFL football and we're pretty confident we'll have a player. He's saying that it's very early, he's got plenty of work to do. Lockie Well was a sub late, so it was pretty hard to judge him. You know, I thought Lockie Neal was probably our best midfielder, 10 clearances, 33 touches, so he's continued on. Um, I thought Max Duffy gave himself a real opportunity. Yeah, so there's a bit to like. Crosby and Sheridan, they were solid, probably could have done more to pick themselves for round one. But um, they weren't disastrous, but they were just solid, probably would have liked them. And Tanner Smith, look at the end of the day, Tanner, you know, we demoted to our rookie list and he's trained on. And look, we let him play on Goods and Franklin and, and those sort of things. So that can only be a win for him, can't it? You know, so as you, it's, it's a good question because as you drill in, there's probably a bit more to like than you probably think on the surface. So, um, yeah. No, you left. Oh, you said the other day McFarlane would stay right, but Sandy as well. Was it more of the same? No, well, he tightened up. So, um, yeah, he's a unique frame, obviously. So we're hopefully or expectant that he'll play against um, West Coast. But I thought he'd play here and didn't. So I <laughs> thought maybe it was a smart move in the end. So, um, But, yeah, he should play against West Coast. Well, it's not a balancing act. I mean, at the end of the day, they, they're relatively fresh because I mean, on the CBA, you get two three day breaks. So they've had two consecutive weeks of three day weekends. So it's not like they've been in the club a lot. Maybe it's probably been unders a little bit. So um, look, everyone's going to get a soft tissue. You hope not to get them. It's part of the game. And it's, it's a risk. You know, you try and get through on skates, but it doesn't always work that way. Yeah. Have your right, Silvani. I thought he fought on. I thought the Anderson were pre I thought they defended um, fought on really well. Went on the siege. We couldn't clear the ball. I think clearances were zero ten in the third, and the ball was living in there. And it was, I thought they, and you know, so really out of our back six, you go Spur, Duffield, McFarlane, sort of and Dawson firmed that up. So I thought under pressure they held reasonably, but there's a lot of talent going against them as well. Yeah, I, I think um, he's carving out an AFL career for himself. Did you see the Walters report on um, I haven't got the sheet that he's reported. Is that official? Or? Mm -hmm. You've been told, yeah. Yeah, no, I didn't see it. Thanks, Thank, Thank you. you. Cheers.